Hey guys, my name's Island. Welcome to my channel. In today's video, I thought I'd give you guys 10 fun things to kill time when you're bored or stuck in quarantine from a deadly virus. As we know, COVID-19, otherwise known as the coronavirus, has us all quarantined at home with nothing to do. So to kill off time, I thought I'd give you guys some fun activities to do. So before we begin the video, I just wanted to quickly note on hashtag flatten the curve. Basically, hashtag flatten the curve is a new scientific theory based on a way we can actually combat coronavirus. So the curve researchers are talking about refers to the projected number of people who will get COVID-19 over a period of time. Here's what one of the graphs looks like. So as you can see, there's a curve. This curve takes on different shapes depending on the virus's infection rate. It could be a steep curve in which the virus spreads exponentially. So the faster the infection curve rises, the quicker the local healthcare systems get overloaded beyond its capacity to treat people, just as we are seeing in Italy. As there are no current vaccine or specific medication to treat COVID-19, and because testing is so limited in the United States, the only way to flatten the curve is through collective action and start social distancing. Social distancing means we all have to stay inside of our homes and try to limit social contact as much as possible. You should stay home! It may be boring, but it's gonna help so many people around you. You kind of have to go into the mindset just as if you have the virus and what you would do to treat others around you. And if we all act together, we may see a rapid decline in cases. But that's only if we work together to stop the virus. Anyways, back to the video. Number one, clean your room. So as we know, we're going to be stuck in our rooms for a long, long period of time with nothing to do. And your room is an environment. Just by cleaning your room, you're practically refreshing the environment you're going to be staying in for a long time. And it's really important that an environment you're staying in for a long time is as neat and tidy as possible. Number two, you can even make some TikToks. With all of this time to spare, hop on your phone, make some new TikToks, maybe watch some TikTok videos. TikTok is actually pretty fun when you get into it, so I totally recommend just going on your phone if you get bored and just filming a few TikTok videos. Recently, I've been really into doing loads of TikTok dances because I'm actually finding it pretty fun to learn all of these dances. If you are stuck at home with some family members, try make some TikToks with them or make some TikToks of your pets or your makeup routine. Number three, learn a new skill, whether that be cooking, baking, knitting, drawing, anything that you can do to kill time, maybe even bust out a puzzle for goodness sake and become a master puzzle person. I used to really like knitting when I was really little and I kind of forgot about that hobby I picked up so now that the virus is here and I'm stuck at home, I've started to pick up knitting again and it's been super fun and super relaxing. You have plenty of time to pick up a new skill. Number four, maybe do some painting. So as many of my viewers know, I'm a complete art freak. I love art so much and I'm always painting and drawing. Painting and drawing is a very good way to kill time, especially when you get into it. As an artist myself, I know for a fact that once you get into a drawing, <laughs> You kind of lose track of time and you're just painting for hours and hours. It sounds dreadful, but when you get really invested into one of your paintings, time just goes by so quickly. And at the end of it, you're left with a beautiful product that you can use to show your friends. Number five! Why did I do ten? Number five! Play around with your makeup. This goes for all the guys watching too. Makeup is pretty fun. I used to absolutely suck at makeup and I still do, but the more you practice, the better you get. I've been very into going online and searching like aesthetic makeup looks and trying them out myself. And I don't really have that much makeup, but it's fun to just try some creative looks. Do a cool bold look, do some eyeshadow, do a rainbow for goodness sake. Experimenting with makeup is so much fun. Try some makeup challenges with your friends, do a blindfolded makeup challenge. Let a wheel decide the colors you're wearing. Number six. Do some exercise or some yoga. Oh, ow. Do some dancing. We're stuck at home for such a long period of time. You gotta exercise a bit. I know it sounds dreadful and I know nobody wants to, but when you're at home doing absolutely nothing for a few hours, it's good to always stand up and do some stretches. In my opinion, I'm not the kind of person to get up and do a workout routine every day. So usually when I'm listening to music, I'll just get up and dance a bit. It sounds kind of embarrassing, but it's actually really fun. Whatever can get you guys moving is honestly really good for you. I'm trying to get into the habit of trying out yoga, but I cannot stretch to save my life. It sounds lonely, but what can we do? We're in quarantine! Oh, ow, my back! Ow. 
back. And, you know, it's kind of embarrassing after all my years of dance training. I can't do any of this anymore. I can do like this. No, I can't. Ooh, I can do it. Look at that. Chest pull. Number seven, make some food or order some food. See, about ordering food, be careful because you're a delivery person. You don't know where they've been. You don't know if they have the virus. Maybe don't order food, but maybe try make some food. Because when I'm bored, I'm hungry. I don't know why. I just like eating when I'm bored. So maybe make yourself some cool snacks. Learn how to cook or bake a new recipe. Making some healthy snacks or making some unhealthy snacks doesn't really matter because we're in quarantine. Just try something new. Maybe try out some new recipes. For example, for dinner today, we tried making our own homemade pizzas because we couldn't really order from outside. And honestly, it was way more fun. And in the end, you get a really nice treat to eat. Number eight, watch some movies or YouTube. For me, I'm lazy and I absolutely love watching videos. That's probably one of the reasons I became a YouTuber. I love just sitting at my computer and watching videos for hours and I think you guys will too. YouTube has millions of videos. I know you guys can find something. And if you're not in the mood to watch any movies or YouTube videos, maybe make a YouTube video. And I know YouTube isn't for everyone, but maybe you can just download iMovie on your phone and make some fun trailers by yourself if you get really bored. When I was little, whenever I would get bored, I would always make video stars or iMovie trailers. And honestly, it was such a fun thing to do. And just watching back on the videos gives you such a fun laugh at the end. Number nine, build a fort. I know for a fact that the majority of people watching this video have definitely built a fort when they were younger and it's so much fun. If you've never built a fort after this video, go build a fort. Building forts is so much fun. Add some fairy lights, add some pillows, get some snacks, just chill in your fort. Watch a movie. Honestly, the process of building a fort takes a lot of time, especially for someone like me who has no idea about anything to do with architecture or building things. And honestly, having a fort in your room is pretty cool, especially during the quarantine. This is actually kind of comfortable. I like this. It's trash, but so am I. Wow, who needs a house when you have a fort? We be vibing. Look at this! Hey! Finally, number 10, do some skincare. It's important to take care of yourself during quarantine. We're stuck inside for so many hours, not going outside to get fresh air. Make sure you keep yourself clean, wash regularly, clean regularly, and don't forget to take care of your skin. And even if you don't want to, and maybe even develop a skincare routine while you're in quarantine. It's super fun and it's super fun to take care of yourself. Even if you're not an avid skincare person, just doing a mask every now and then is super fun, super relaxing. If you didn't like any of these 10 things that I put, here is a quick bonus round where I'm just going to quickly go through just a few small things that won't necessarily take up a lot of time, but are definitely fun things to do if you don't want to do any of these. Color a picture. Do your homework. Play a board game. Read a book. Play with some Legos or Play-Doh. Go looking through old pictures. FaceTime a friend. Play with your pets. Take a nap. Try some DIY projects. Paint your nails. Organize your closet. Learn to do origami. Listen to some music. Write a song and make some music. If you have a Wii, play on your Wii. If you have a gaming console, play some games. Annoy your siblings. Sing a song. Write a poem. Film or watch some music videos. Take another nap. Make a photo album of all your memories. Have a movie or show marathon. This is one I'm definitely going to be doing. Take a bubble bath. Just scroll through some social media. Try make yourself the ultimate coffee recipe. Have a picnic by yourself. Research some conspiracy theories. Maybe even learn how to juggle. Those are some things that I was thinking of doing in quarantine, but I'm pretty lazy, so I'm probably just gonna sleep for the entire time, kind of take this as a hibernation kind of session. So I hope you guys like these ideas. If you like this video, I'd really appreciate it if you subscribe to my channel. I am a growing channel. So every subscriber and every like counts. I'd really appreciate it if you could like this video so YouTube can recommend it to more people. Show it to your friends, send the links to people. I'll really appreciate any support I can get from my channel. I love you guys so much and bye!